what can bring to cancer manifestation when you do your manifestation you have to be very honest and clear about what you wish to manifest in your life write it down on paper that's manifestation step one so need to write what you want to manifest the universe is telling you i'm confused i don't know what cancer wants right i get that <laughs> sometimes it's you may be um, confused about what you want also. The Fairy Queen of Light comes to shed love and light onto your current situation and to remind you that light can penetrate the darkness. So, you're going to be enlightened and also if you're in the dark about something, light is coming so stretch your wings and fly don't underestimate yourself assert your independence and creativity this is the queen of fire gaining more confidence you're going to feel more confidence you're going to have more uh, wisdom you're going to show that you you're using your mind a lot and you're also very graceful and warm with others and this confidence is beautiful, Cancer. Page of Water. A new person enters your life. A relationship could begin a new phase. And your psychic abilities will be heightened. So more psychic abilities, more um, a sensitive, caring, intuitive energy here. There is a friend that is, uh, it, this could start as a friendship. You may already have this person around you. There's fire or water, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces or Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I do see from somewhere there is a lot of sea. You see the King of Water? He's definitely a water sign. Trustworthy, someone that is, <clears throat> if he's not a water sign, is someone that you can trust, someone that is respected, someone that has uh, is cultured. Open your heart and mind to those around you. Trustworthy and heartfelt advice. Also, someone that works or does things for charity. Or are you gonna do more more of that? You're gonna feel like giving. That that's one thing I felt today. Uh, I was watching some um, documentaries and I felt like giving back even financially to you know some some of these people that are really struggling in some countries you know and you go online and you see sometimes their rent is like a hundred pounds a month for a hundred dollars hundred and fifty dollars and we live this these are third world world countries. And we live in these, uh, you know, I live in Europe and you pay over a thousand, almost, you know, thousands of pounds and or dollars in rents. And I just felt like, wow, I could provide this. So you may feel like that. You may feel that you want to help more, uh, especially because also my heart chakra is definitely open. Um... And this is what can happen to you, Cancer. It could really open your, your heart to, to be more um, charit charitable even and have someone help others or have someone that can help you, okay? Being too cautious with money, but you have good, good business decisions here. Giving to those less fortunate, you see? Because you're making good decisions and you're careful with your money, but you also feel very given. So you could give more. And when you give, you receive. All right. If you're looking for a relationship, there is a friendship here. Could start as an open relationship, but there's new friends, um, family. Uh, this is a blended family, so maybe they have children or you meet through 
it's a family friend. Karma. So this is a new door. Releasing. Also, I see uh, if you're not in good terms with your family members, I do see uh, you getting together and being a being united again with your family. Some of you. Or friends like family. You're meeting friends like, you know, this is going to be... They, so, they like family to you. Okay, we've got the lovers. Could be a Gemini, a Libra with justice. This could also, it's, you know, I do see friends with benefit type of relationship. Friends with, friends and lovers. Lovers and friends. And... There is um, hmm. justice here reversed. Okay, so things need to balance out in your all your relationships. Okay, but this could be someone that needs your help, needs needs you needs you to balance them out, or you need them to find this balance in your life, okay? I do see that. Three of Wands, you've been waiting for this. Uh, you could, you just need to, to be more confident and take a leap of faith here, I feel. Also planning. Some of you will come out of being single, okay, three of pentacles, there is an awakening for, you've got the high priestess, you've got strong spiritual awakening here, your spirituality, your intuition is going to be off the charts, you could be learning something new also, connected to the occult, to astrology, um, you know, even tarot. And the Nine of Swords reverse. So get out of your head and stop fearing. There is um, fear. Also, t thinking too much about the future. It's good to have a plan, but don't worry too much. Live, live the moment. Enjoy the moment. Cancer. Codependency. New love. Separation. Playfulness. Oh, wow. Okay. 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 There's a long story here. There is someone new. They could be from a distance. You know, different... There's a lot of good times with this person, even going on a holiday together. Um, but there is some things that you're doing or they, they're constantly doing or they may be codependent. If they have addictions, be mindful of that. It could lead to a separation. Um, some of you, if you've been separated from someone, there is a new beginning here with an ex. Maybe your love life was affected by children before. Okay, I do see an open relationship with someone that, um, you know, it's telling you to enjoy the moment and don't think too much about the future with them. They want to live in a moment. They may have... Um, a lot of responsibilities, especially if they have children. And it's telling you to be positive, stay positive. This will bring um, romance. You're going to disconnect a lot with this person, so you're going to spend a lot of good times with them. And I feel this is just the beginning, Cancer. All right. 
Thank you so much. Hope it helps. Pisces, welcome to your Eclipse reading. Healing. Protect your dreams. Protect. Don't tell anyone your dreams and also protect here. Uh, keep them safe and uh, until keep them close to your heart until you're ready to release them and you've got healing to do you can also heal other people so that's that could be your purpose a healer pisces you could be a healer the emperor okay that could be a business that you could um, start self-employment need to be organized leadership some of you it's a leadership position you have plans protect them don't tell anyone life experience you may have already gained some experience in this field um defend your beliefs choose, choose your battles wisely there is some drama coming from people that you work with i see boss if you work for someone there's a um, change a particular powerful revelation okay there's some news coming in so don't reveal what you have you know your plan b your plan a your plan c Whatever plan you have, don't reveal it before this, this revelation here. Time to spread your wings. Maybe you're telling them you're leaving. you telling... Um, don't tell them everything, though. Review and evaluate. Uh, time to move in a new direction. Yeah. Yes. That's what's telling you. You came to the end of the road or uh, maybe a relationship you need time to heal or a job powerful okay there could have been a third party you found out about a third party are you going to find out but for others of you the team player you need a team around you if you work with a team you need to be more hands-on here working with them and there's power in creativity if you do anything creative you need someone creative around you someone that you can trust fire sign maybe someone that is already self-made self-employed um let's go. okay let's pisces 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 oh the lovers Okay, so we've got love, Gemini energy with the Emperor. Okay, so it could be a Gemini as well. The Hangman. Yeah, you're going to find out about, um, you know, someone has more than one lover. You could be going back to a Gemini, some of you. Oh, Gemini could come back to you. Gemini, Scorpio, and Aries. Ten of Pentacles, someone with money. They could have family as well, or you do. Seven of Cups. All right, there's a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Yeah, okay. So this is a risky relationship. You feel um, you don't want to take many risks. You do have options, but you're a bit confused. You could be with someone that has a lot of options, a lot of females or males around them or whatever they, they like around them. Okay, the moon and the nine of pentacles. So the, ah, yeah. The revelation could be that this person is already taken, is already in a relationship, or you, it's going to come to light that you already in a relationship all right there is um someone that doesn't really trust you 
the hermit. Rather be by themselves. You could be dealing with a Virgo, some of you, or you, you're going to spend time introspection. You need to find out some things about this person, okay? They may not take a risk in, in marrying you, in the commitment with you because they have someone else, okay? They may be already in a relationship or they have family with someone else and, and they don't want to commit to you. Even, gosh. Right, we've got, yeah, we've got, um, what's this, Pisces? You've got September, that revelation. Yeah, you see Five of Swords and the, the Taurus, Taurus card, uh, Hierophant. Could be a divorce. Five of Swords. Not telling you that they could have told you that they divorce. Divorce. <laughs> Watch how they say it. <laughs> oh, I'm divorced. Uh -uh. You're lying. <laughs> Not. <laughs> Um, <laughs> Pisces, there is someone here. A lot of arguments that need to end if you are in a relationship. Otherwise, there is going to be betrayal. I see. Pisces. Past life union gem you're gonna feel that this is meant to be could be a twin flame you have a past life the dark male triangle told you they could be married they could be married could be the, uh, the dark male could be in a relationship already mature Dark hair, dark eyes, dark skin, dark male. And you've got a young male that is just for fun. But they could be acting like the young male, you see. They could be mature, but they... Yeah, because the young male came out in the reverse, so they're not very young. But they just want some fun. That's what I'm seeing. Gifts, control, karma. surprises here and feeling a little bit restricted this is a comic that you need to let go of they could even get you pregnant or they could just give you a lot of gifts you know take you out give you a lot of gifts just so they can camouflage their misdoings or their their did 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 divorce okay or whatever it doesn't need to be on paper could be that they're still attached to someone there's a triangle someone they just wanna if it's you Pisces you're still choosing having fun you could break someone's heart though if you're not honest someone really sees you as their true gem Commitment, once commitment, once wants you to behave. <laughs> I'm hearing. <laughs> wants you to behave. All right, my Pisces. Okay, I hope it helps. Did I take the Roman Angels? I didn't. Pisces. Let your friends help you. This could be the one. You need the you need you need the other people help from others. For this person to be optimistic towards you or you know this yeah forgiving and learning. They're gonna have to forgive you or you're gonna have to forgive them. Honeymoon. Someone that's going in and out 
uh, of a marriage, okay? Could also be someone that you had a relationship with in the past. You had a lot of good times. You're kind of renewing that, the vows or renewing, um, yeah. But there's an X around. There's someone that you, or is into, is the ex that is interfering with your relationship, with you committing or with this person committing to you? There was someone serious in their life or in your life, even a marriage. Okay. D -d 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 -d. Divorce. The divorcee that is not a divorcee. Yeah, there could be renewal of... You know, you're going back to someone you you got divorced. Yeah. Trying to work on the relationship. But do you see a lot of factors, obstacles? Could be your religious, your spiritual path even, or your upbringing, culture, background, the things that you believe. You're not on the same page. That's the thing. Take care, Pisces. Bye-bye. Scorpio, welcome to your... Eclipse reading. Scorpio, Scorpio. Look in a book. Go outside and there's transformation, big change. Some of you change here. I'm seeing hairstyle. Um, transformation in your life is happening for the highest good. Embrace your transformation. The best is yet to come. So you're going to feel a lot of change. Um, whatever your question is right now, you'll find the answer in a book. The words you find will bring you insight, the insight you seek. Look in a book. Hmm. I'm telling you to read, Scorpio. There's a particular book that you need to read. Maybe buying more books. Let's see, Scorpio Eclipse Balance. Okay, happy outcome in a strength is here. A strong Leo and Libra energy. The need for balance and moderation, finding that strength, releasing half ju uh, harsh judgments, forgiveness, and compassion information I heard you're gonna get information from a Leo information about a Leo information that you're gonna have it's it's like a secret I feel something not yet something that's not revealed I feel by August you have this, uh, you know, to juggle something, especially your money. But by August, you're going to feel stable, okay? Financially stable, enjoying life's little luxuries. And then you're going to have a very happy outcome, especially doing uh, something connecting to your work, yes, self-employment. Starting your new and uh, your business, a brilliant new idea that leads to success. So by August you may you may start your own business or become self -employ uh, employed, deciding to just work for yourself. Scorpio, if you are already self employed, look another card of self employment. Another card of enjoying luxury. Could be also a single card. Enjoying being single. For once didn't work out with someone. A relationship didn't work out. Or there isn't any commitment there. From a cancer, the chariot. Some of you are going to be traveling, like short travel in a car, back and forth. You're going to spend little time at home. You're going to 
feel like traveling a lot but short short travel short distance travel you know in a car it doesn't need to be short short but a lot of car travel may buy a new car as well you got a queen of cups um you may be involved with a water sign and the hermit is a virgo so I see, I see lack of action here in coming out of your shell, in coming out of, you know, you need to really take back control of your life. There is a secret coming to light, okay, in regards to, again, the moon to a water sign. Ten of Pentacles. Why you broke up? It doesn't need to be a water sign. This is, could be your energy as well. You're getting out of confusion. Confusion about your um, family situation, relationship. You're letting go. You're letting go of. letting go of a bad relationship some of you and you and you're going towards someone new but you haven't even connected with them yet intimately oh the devil could be a capricorn with someone very attractive they're very the chemistry is there strong They're a bit kinky as well, I see. <laughs> King of Cups again. Or oh, you are this you you are being the devil here, Scorpio. You reversed. You you're not wanting to fall in love. You want some fun. You want some fun here. Page of Pentacles with a magician. Hmm. Showing your skills in work. You could be connecting to your younger earth sign or an Aries. Yeah, King of Wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. But the King of... This is someone that wants to pursue you, take you out. It's very passionate. There's a lot of, uh, also the King of Wands, I'm getting this, I don't know why. One of you may wear your hair blonde or light, light, light complexion as well, light skin complexion. Someone, it's not for all. But lightish for the background, so, or maybe you've dated, I'm seeing a different type before eight of cups so it could be someone that's coming back and you're manifesting them coming back to you you've manifested this person though could be an ex that left you or you left them and you're manifesting them back But it's a very um, um, the chemistry is there getting to know each other revealing each other's feelings revealing you know getting to know them properly they could have children but they're separated from their partner or you or you have children and you're gonna get to know each other again after a separation, it's a soulmate, it's an ex that you're going to reconcile. <laughs> wow, it couldn't be more straightforward here. Reconciliation with your soulmates. I mean, for some of you, it could be a past life. Yeah, it could be a past life past life relationship reconciling and you may have an ex around you still
A lot of people meeting their soulmates. And this is soulmate energy. Rarely even one or two had twin flame. I think only one actually. Triangle, mature man, past life. Okay. So there could be you here making a decision, having, you know, short-term relationships, even if you're already mature. You could connect with a lot of people for work, meet a lot of people that have dating potential, dating people from your work that you meet through work. You could meet the mature man. If you're looking for a man, if you're looking for a female, there is someone new. There's a dating queen. Someone that's available. Oh, twin flame. Okay, so, and it's a friendship or, can, or you're meeting through friends, introduction. Friends with money, you've been friends. Okay, it's going to start as a friendship and it's someone that can spiritually, you can spiritually grow with. I feel you're on the same level of spirituality. You also have a lot of friends, you know, you have a good um, uh, soul family. Friends that you can actually, you don't need to say much, just you can understand each other very well because you're on this, you're on the same vibe, you're on the same vi vibration, yes. Some of you manifesting a twin flame and there is. Looks like it's new and it's someone with, someone with money. Right, did I take the Roma Sangers? I did take everything. Okay, I'm just going to put a card on a new love. Seven of Cups. So you need to make a decision. Uh, you may have choices here, but this is narrowing down your options. I feel that some of you have an ex around. You're going to be dealing with an ex, and then you're going to meet someone new, and that's going to be someone you're going to stick with. <laughs> stick to. King, uh, the Knight of Swords and the Emperor, you see, Knight of Swords and Gemini energy here. But I, I see that wow, the moon, bright, bright, the eclipse could be friends of this friend that is an Aries or Knight of Swords. Is someone very, uh, they've, they're mature, they know what they want and they're not really rushing. They're very cautious. Strong personality. They've achieved a lot in the, in their work. They could be, yeah, self-employed. And you also have that here for you. You're becoming this strong, your own boss. If you're not already. But this is not something that you're going to be able to rush with this person or you're, going, you're not going to rush this uh, it's going to happen, but um, even the communication, the communication could take, could take a while. This person is not very open to communicate, or you may be holding back at first. Let's see. All right. I hope it helps finances and career. So it could be connected to your work. Someone that you work with as well. All right. Scorpio, thank you so much. Hope it helps. You see the work there? Dating. Mm-hmm. 
Take care. Bye-bye.